Hello students, how are you all? Hope going great, doing well at home. Today, I am again back with my new topic in class 3, multiplication. Hope you have covered whatever we have done till now. It is completely understood by you. Now, today the topic is multiplication. Children, we have already covered many topics like addition, subtraction and all. And like that, multiplication is also equally important in our daily life. Now, before telling any other thing, we will know about what is multiplication. What is multiplication? Children, we are going to connect here this multiplication with addition. So, we all know how, what is addition and how do we add? So, by taking an example, suppose I am taking a number 5. And I want to add this number repeatedly. So suppose I want to add 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus 5 and plus 5. I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I have 6, 5. And now I want to add my all these 5. How you will add? Will you add like this? 5 plus 5, 10 plus 5, 15. 20, 25, 30. Okay. 30 is the answer. Are we going to do like this? No. We are not going to do like this. If again here multiplication comes. When the same number is repeating again and again. Here multiplication is coming and helping us. How? So what you will see. This is the right way. You will see the number of times. The given number is repeating. So it is repeating 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 5 is repeating 6 times. So I have written 6 here. Multiply which number is repeating? 5. 6, 5, 30. This is the actual way of doing. Now, how you will identify whether you will be doing like this or like this? Only one thing you need to take care which is if the same number is repeating again and again. Then you will use multiplication. Let's take one more example. Suppose I have a number 8 plus 5 plus 6 plus 9 plus 2. Here multiplication will not help because you can see all the addends are different. And what is added? Addends are those numbers which are added. Alright. So here we can see all the numbers are different. Here we cannot solve like this. We can only solve like this when you have the same number repeatedly repeated. Okay. Then only you can use this method. But here we have to use same addition method. Separately you have to use or you have to add all the numbers to get their sum. Alright. Now we can take one more example. Suppose now 8 I am having. And it is repeating four times. So here I can identify that I can use multiplication here. I can take the help of multiplication because 8 is repeating only. Only the same number is repeatedly repeating. So how you will do? 8 is repeating how many times? 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 will come here. And which number is repeating? 8. 4 8s are 32. This is your answer. So actually what we got to know after solving these sums? We got to know that multiplication is nothing but just a repeated addition. When the same number is repeating, that means we can take the help of multiplication. So what is multiplication? You can easily answer. Multiplication is repeated addition. Hope we are clear with the concept of multiplication. Alright. Okay. So, now we are done. What is multiplication? Second, why multiplication? Why multiplication? So, let's take some example. Suppose, nothing else but can we see this marker? Marker? If I say, cost of one marker is rupees 25. 
is rupees 25. Now, I want to buy 9 markers. If I want to buy 9 markers, in this case, cost is not going to be changed. If the cost of 1 marker is 25, that means I want to know the number of markers, which I have to mention here. Number of markers, which are 9. That means, cost of 9 markers. What are you going to do? Are you going to do like this? Here we will write. 25 plus 25 plus 25 plus 25. That means what I am doing. Can you see? I am writing 25 9 times. How many times I have done? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 3 more. Are you going to do like this? Is it the right way? I already know that the cost of 9 markers I have to pay and the cost of 1 marker is 25. In case of 9 markers, cost is going to be same. What I will do? Whether I will do this or you will do this. Which is the right option? Which is the right solution? Isn't it this? Because same number is repeating 9 times and rule says when the add end is same, when the number is same and it is repeating again and again, we simply multiply that number by the number of times it is repeating. So here I can see my cost is repeating 9 times. So it's better I will solve like this, not like this. This is wrong. We are not going to do this though you are going to get the same answer. But... Method will be this. It is a long method. To avoid that long journey, we have opted this method. Because again I am saying, same number is repeating repeatedly. So let's multiply. 9 fives are 45. 4 carry over. 9 to the 18. 89 to 4. 22. So, cost of Nine markers will be rupees 225. So, is it clear? This is one of the examples which I have taken to make you clear. But there are many more. Suppose it's your birthday and you want to buy on your birthday for your friends one water bottle. And to avoid any fight between them, you are going to buy the same water bottle. And the cost of one water bottle is rupees 90. And number of children if 18, what you will do? You will simply multiply and find the total cost which is to be paid to the shopkeeper. That means we will use multiply because only 90 is repeating. How many times? 18 times. When the same number is repeating, so what will be used? Multiplication. Hope it is very much ignorant. Hope it is clear that where to use multiplication and why do we use multiplication. Alright. So I hope now that I made you clear that what is multiplication which is repeated addition with same added. And why multiplication when the same number is repeating again and again. So to avoid long calculation we use multiplication. Alright. In my next video, I will be coming up, coming up with the rules and properties of multiplication which is equally important to do the calculation part. Alright, till that time, stay home, stay safe. Bye-bye.